This Friday, the fifth and final Indiana Jones film will hit theaters. Harrison Ford says it has been a treasured part of his life and career for 42 years. In Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny, he's about to hang up his hat until one woman pulls him into one final adventure. Alicia Vitarelli talked with the cast. I'm retiring. Well, in that case, what are we drinking? Same for the goddaughter. His life is a bit in disarray and Along comes uh, this creature, this Phoebe Waller Bridge, uh, who inviggles him into one last uh, adventure. She plays Helena Shaw, the daughter of Basil, a friend of Indiana Jones and fellow archaeologist. Dad told me you found something on a train during the war, a dial that could change the course of history. Helena and Indy are up against Nazis to recover that ancient artifact. You stole it. Then you stole it. And then I stole it. It's called capitalism. Phoebe, you get to be the woman who calls Indiana Jones out of retirement. Yes, yes. <laughs> That's a, that was a great moment in the script, actually, that he has to be... Because he, he's, he's experiencing some ennui in his life. He's not sure where he fits anymore. Taking your chances. Made your mistakes. And now, a final triumph. And so he needs someone to come in and, and ignite that fire. She comes in and tries to inspire him to have one last adventure. And foolishly. Seanette Renee Wilson is Mason, a CIA agent who is sort of in their way. Dr. Jones, I'm not gonna hurt you. Inspired a little Seanette to, to want to be archaeologists. <laughs> I want to go on uh, explorations and, and discovery. We were born into an Indiana Jones world uh, and grew up with those movies. So to actually, the fact that they, they made this film in the first place is so special. Anyway, I would have been so excited anyway, let alone actually then being in it.